What do I mean by... What should I call it? It's like this spinning around thing, this dancing, this synchronization with the universe, this becoming the... Really what it is, is becoming the Logos. And that really is the whole sort of story of awakening, really. Because um, Christ Jesus was the Logos. In the beginning was the Word, okay, but in Greek, that's in the beginning was the Logos. And it's the Word is not quite a very good translation of it, because it, it means more sort of concept or that which experiences, is the way that Jordan Peterson would say. So it's like it's the, it's kind of the, it's the instance of consciousness and the law of one made me think that it's kind of, it's the center point of the, the axis of rotation is that the universe has a rotation and in the beginning was a rotation and it had a, a, a principal axis and the axis I mean, in a spinning body, the axis isn't a thing. It is just, you know, it's an implied thing because the, the body is spinning and, you know, it has an axis. But the axis isn't a stick. It's not a pole running through it. It's just a stationary axis. It is not a thing, but it is, it exists. <laughs> okay, so that's like, that's like, God, that's like the principle of creation, that's like the word, that's the logos, that's the Christed being, being at the centre of the manifested universe in that instance. Complicated, I know. Anyway, <laughs> so, but for years and years and years, I'd done this circle dancing years and years ago. I did the circle dancing. And so during my course of my spiritual awakening then, I became aware that drugs was not doing it anymore. So I became, I sort of started to become through this sort of situation of being run only by my logic and leaving the state of warfare that I have in previous videos described. I started to come more into this feeling world where I could use the feeling and the power of the Holy Spirit to manifest things. I was like, right, okay, I'm doing this. And so I started a 12-step program to get them off drugs, off all drugs. I did that with Russell Brand on a commune thing at the beginning of the year. It was like a free opportunity. I was like, I'm going to do that. I'm going to stop taking drugs. <laughs> and I, as part of that is, a, is an inventorying process where you write down all of your resentments. And it's about stopping this, like... I'm separate and I resent these people for these things and I feel good about myself on account of the ways I'm better than these other people or the way that I'm a victim of them and I'm righteous in my victimhood situation and moving into this kind of I'm I, rel I am a conscious connected spiritual being in my own right I do not require drugs alcohol um, or like relationships to depend on to make me whole i am whole in my own right i am whole in the spiritual light of creation <laughs> uh, so yeah and then there was this i had smoked some weed i had <laughs> let's be honest about it but it was the last time that i did before i had a very long period i smoked some more recently but only just like occasionally because i was proper smoking every day i needed it i needed it I needed it I needed it um, and this is drug-free rave dancing. They call it ecstatic dance. And I went to this thing and I was wearing my ring. I had smoked a little bit of weed. But I was like, I didn't, it was on acid that I did the first spinning round thing. It was years ago. I was like, I didn't really know. But I totally, I've, I've remained connected to that circle energy ever since. I really have. And so I went back to this place then and just this room, no drugs, no, dr I had smoke some weed, sorry, is no drunk, no drugs, no drink, no speaking, no touching, no partner dancing. It's just, you're dancing on your own in a room full of people dancing. 
ecstasy, ecstatic dance. And I completely like what I felt. And people were coming out and they were glowing. It was the most incredible night. I took my place. I took my place in the center of the circle. I did. I became the Logos in that event. Like unifying the energies of everyone in the room and inspiring. And I was, I mean, I was, I was spinning around on one leg, like everything was spinning. Like this. I was sort of sober. I had one hit on a bone, man. Um, so that's kind of what I mean by it's like a physical manifestation of the logos. I'm not sure what the title of the video, video was, but that's what I mean by it. Becoming the spin center of the universe, in my instance of the universe. Um, and that that is, that is the outcome of spiritual awakening. Becoming the Logos, becoming the Word, becoming the Creator. That is what that is. And it's a universal thing, you know. I've sort of known these concepts for years, but I wouldn't allow myself into the, you know, into the situation of like, it's what one would call the Messiah complex, right? It's complicated. It's like, oh, I am the, you know, you realize your Christness, your Logosness, your like individual spiritual ultimate infinite connection to everything and creation. <laughs> and you're like, all oh, right, I'm the second coming. <laughs> But it's like not like that, and thank goodness it isn't. So I certainly wouldn't have spoken about it before this period of mass spiritual awakening and mass Christing of individuals by spiritual awakening that is going on now. Um, so I was like, I don't want to do that. I don't want to be the one. Do you know what I mean? Like off of June or off of like what any of those things. I wouldn't speak about that, but I can speak about it now because here's something which is going on. So I'm not sort of too scared of these concepts anymore I was and I think a lot of people get taken down a very dark road by thinking that they are you know because if the ego gets hold of that sort of concept and starts thinking it's better than everybody else because it's the one that's dangerous stuff man that's dangerous but peace out it's all good that's what we're all doing that's what we're here for this is the nature of the human experience is to complete and in completing the human experience we've entered a Christed state and that's not a male only thing that's uh, every individual in their spiritual capacity as individuals has ability to complete themselves into a Christed state. That's just what that is. <laughs>